You're watching a segment of The Splash, Greater West Bloomfield's news magazine show. Welcome back to The Splash. I'm Jonathan Jackson, and joining me at the desk this week is Chef Annabelle Cohen, who owns a local catering business here in West Bloomfield called Annabelle Cohen Cooks Detroit. She's also an author, cooking instructor, and stylist, just to name a few things. So, Annabelle Cohen, thanks for joining me today. Thank you. I'm thrilled to be here. Well, we want to talk to you today a little bit about your catering business. How did you get it started? I actually started out of my house. I used to have, in my past life, I worked in advertising, and um, people would bring... Uh, foods into the uh, into the building, the office. They'd bring donuts and and uh, bagels, and I would bring you know white chocolate mousse with raspberry sauce. <laughs> and I started bringing more and more foods. We'd have muffin Mondays and tube steak Tuesdays, and it was a whole lot of fun. And uh, I was asked to cater something at the office really? at the ad agency where I worked, and I just loved it. So I quit my job. I went to work for a caterer to learn all their secrets, mm -hmm. and I realized there really were no secrets. They just did a lot of good cooking in bigger quantities. Okay, okay. And then how did you end up, you know, owning your own place here in West Bloomfield? How did that come about? Well, I um, started working actually out of my home, and uh, I worked for several years, and then I went back into my advertising career. Oh, okay. And yeah. then back into catering about four years ago or so, full-time. And uh, I worked out of a uh, religious building uh, for a, a little while and then I needed more space and I opened up uh, here in West Bloomfield. Nice, mm -hmm. nice. Now it's a uh, little fun fact about you that I read was you originally just made food for friends and family, not really anybody else. Yeah, I catered but, for friends and yeah, family. Yeah, yeah, but now you know you're catering for you know businesses and events and gatherings and Weddings, all this. Weddings, bar mitzvahs, all exactly. kinds of Exactly, you're, uh -huh. you're definitely a busy person to Very say the busy. least. <laughs> Luckily <laughs> I have a great team. Right, right. I mean what is you know some of the items that are famous on your catering menu? We do all kinds of foods, but mm -hmm. I'm a world traveler. I've been a lot of different places. So wherever, whenever I go someplace, I bring those flavors back with me mm -hmm. and it, so, to sort of incorporate them into the foods. Okay. But this is a, you know, West Bloomfield is a very um, sort of a high-end clientele. Most of our clients, because I don't advertise, are in Bloomfield, Birmingham, West Bloomfield, Farmington Hills, this area. Mm -hmm. And because it's all word of mouth, uh, People like what they see and they want to see it again. So I haven't answered your question yet, <laughs> but um, I want to um, preface it by saying that most of our clients eat very, very healthy foods. So we don't do, we don't even own a deep fryer. We don't have a freezer. Everything is fresh. Everything nothing is deep fried. Okay. And uh, so some of the things that we do, we do sort of often. We do a lot of fish. People love salmon. We do salmon a hundred different ways. We do um, beautiful cuts of beef and lamb that people also really enjoy. Okay. And a lot, a lot of salads. I have to say I'm pretty well known for my salads because I, I love to make them. I love to eat them. Mm. So it's a lot of fun to be creative with the salads. We have a menu on our website and I hesitate to have people actually order from it <laughs> because we it's only a, a minuscule uh, amount of and what, you guys of what actually, we actually do. Right, so, right. In general, what we do is, if I was talking to you, if you were calling me to cater a party, mm -hmm. I'd ask you a million questions. Who's coming? What's the occasion? What are your favorite foods? What is your vision? Right. And then I try to make the menu um, customized to each client's uh, specific uh, desires Taste and desi tastes, etc. Exactly. Yeah, and lifestyle, yeah. too. Okay. I want it to fit who you are as well, not just who I am. I don't want to force feed you a certain... Uh, choose one from column A, one from column B type of menu. I want to make sure that the menus are customized to each um, lifestyle. To each yeah, lifestyle. it's, it's yeah. interesting you mentioned that because I was reading about you and you, lifestyle is important to you. It you is know, very important. You know, you are a foodie, like right? you mentioned, and you're very passionate about food, but you're also involved in writing and, yes. and, and uh, you know, being involved in other forms of, you know, media and writing, like I said, but, you know, lifestyle, can you talk to me a bit about that, how important food is just in general to you? Yeah. Well, it's not just to me, to, uh, to anybody, yeah, right? Yeah. My, um, my slogan, if so, if, if, so to speak, is everybody eats. Right. And it's true, everybody eats, it, but it's really how you eat and what you eat. You can eat foods that will bring you back to Italy, to a small town in Italy where you had pasta or pizza that you really enjoyed. Mm -hmm. uh, you can eat foods that remind you of your childhood. You can eat foods that remind you of a... Um, of, uh, a great restaurant that you really enjoyed. So that that's all lifestyle, travel, uh, eating out, uh, your personal preferences. That's lifestyle. Right. So uh, 
again, I, my lifestyle, I can only talk about myself, is <laughs> I, I love, love to travel. So mm -hmm. I bring my, that sort of lifestyle into my cooking. Okay. And uh, so the, uh, the I guess, lifestyle, what is, I guess we should, I guess, I guess you bring an lifestyle. experience, though. It's yeah, a, it's all about the experience. experience. In general, everything. Yeah. I always say you can get a yeah. piece of chicken anywhere. Right. Right? It's, it's all about the experience of, of uh, how we make the food look. Mm -hmm. and how the food is going to fit into your particular event. Uh, so I'm marrying my food with your particular lifestyle. I don't want people to disrupt their homes when, when we cater. I, I even tell people, don't move all this, don't move all that. <laughs> let's make it work within the space that you have. Let's, let's um, make it work within your personal uh, philosophies about food and how you like to serve things. Some yeah. people are super, super casual, and some people are super, super um, Maybe. fussy, I'm going to say. I guess, or uh, uptight a little bit about their preference. Yeah, yeah a, a little bit. But it should be great no matter what it is. Exactly, yeah. And that's the message. That's, yeah. that's what's important. Exactly, do your best. Exactly. <laughs> well, Chef Annabelle, thank you for sh sharing your vision and your message with us today. We appreciate thank it. Thank you. It's so fun to be here. Yeah, well, we appreciate it. And everyone at home, pay, definitely pay attention to Chef Annabelle and, of course, her re uh, catering business, Cooks Detroit. It's Annabelle great. Annabelle Cohen Cooks Annabelle Detroit. Annabelle Cohen Cooks Detroit. There's, yeah, there's yes. another company. It's a similar name, but mine is Annabelle Cohen Cooks, Cooks Detroit. Cooks Detroit, right, right. Uh, go to my website. Go to my Facebook page. Like me. Check her out. She's got a <laughs> lot to show you guys. Trust me, you don't want to miss out on this place. It's amazing. Amazing. So thanks again. Thank you so much. It's problem. so fun to be here. <laughs> thanks for watching a segment of The Splash. To catch the entire show or other segments, watch us on Comcast Channel 15 or AT&T Channel 99. Or look us up online at thesplash.tv and listen to us on WBLD 89.3, the all-new Blake's FM.